Well, he's where you just went past. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2019 Fall Meet in Hershey. We're checking out this 53 Cunningham C3. See if we get a straight shot of this. These were remarkable, remarkable cars. They were built primarily to go racing. That was it. Briggs Cunningham wanted an American car to win. In order to get uh, his race cars accepted into Le Mans and such, he had to build uh, a certain amount. So he put these out. Yes, that's a Chrysler Hemi under the hood with two, uh, four single barrels going down that common rail. Interesting rig. These cars were built for one reason, to go fast. Just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Very, very unusual, extremely unusual. This is a very rare treat, folks. You just don't see a Cunningham around, especially one for sale. The bodywork is very, very nice, which is a tough thing to do on these cars. If I'm not mistaken, it's all aluminum. See those gauges? They are unique. He raced. This is one of only 20 built. These were built in Palm Beach, Florida. Uh, the bodies were built in Italy by Bignali. And let's see, only one of three black cars. Uh, this one needs restoration. Uh, fully documented. Let's ask. All right, Daniel, can you tell us a little bit more about your Cunningham C3? Cunningham, um, it's the third to last one sold. Uh, they were very difficult to sell in, uh, in 53. This one uh, was one of the last ones uh, that ended up being sold in 54. Mm -hmm. um, ah, okay. By 1964, it actually sold for $150. It was kind of beat up, paint was, was nasty, it was in the hands of a college kid. Um, and then it ended up kind of falling into disrepair. A restoration was started uh -huh. and uh, not really completed. And now there's a few, the, you're starting to see some blemishes. So it's about time somebody restored it again. Mm -hmm. uh, so we bought it, uh, bought it to Hershey to try and find a new owner. Very good, yeah, very good. good. There's a lot of good car people around. And oh my gosh. They and they many. appreciate what a Cunningham is. Yeah, they do. It's, in, it's interesting because uh, there's, there's a, a group of people who have no clue what it is, and there's a group of people who straight out of the shoot know exactly what it is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so it's fun. Well, Briggs uh, built these just to get his race cars homogenized That's so right. he could race at Le Mans. Correct, yeah. Uh, yeah. And running through it, these were second. Uh, yeah, well, we're, we're, I guess we That's have right. to uh, build these things. That's right. And they were selling for over $5,000 new, yeah. which was more than an Eldorado oh, at yeah, the time. Oh, yeah, they were very expensive when they were new. Crazy. Um, now, is the bodywork all aluminum? Aluminum on the front, and I think it's steel. It's steel from here back. Okay. Um, I think they were trying to keep the front end as light as they could because the engine's up front. Yes. And that's a big, you know, cast iron lump. Oh my gosh, um, yes. It has a Chrysler 331 Hemi in it, so it's got a, a big mm -hmm. thumping V8. Yes. And it's great. It's Italian coachwork, uh, body by Vignali, um, and all the running gear is a Ford, Mercury, or Chrysler. So mm -hmm. you sort of get Italian styling without having to mess around with an expensive Italian engine. That's it. Yeah, you get all the horsepower. You can build all yeah. the horsepower you want into it. Oh, it's beautiful. Now, that's uh, Briggs Cunningham's personal induction system, it too. It is, yeah. The, the uh, intake manifold, four single carburetors, um, hey, uh, is a Cunningham manifold. And I love them. Some guys will put a single you know, a uh, single uh, holly or something on them, but I actually like the, the four oh, yeah. single cups. I think it looks great. It does. Yeah. It's yeah. not that bad to balance. Come on, guys. <laughs> You've got the Unitunes. Come on. Yeah. Some That's old right. mechanic That's has right. one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. this is brilliant. Yeah, it's awesome. Just yeah. brilliant. It is. Excellent. Yeah. Daniel, thank you so very much. Right. Oh, I got to ask. Yeah. How much are you asking? How much am I asking? Well, the last three that have sold, uh, sold for 1.1 mil, 1.2 and 1.3 million. Mm -hmm. uh, this one, um, since it needs restoration, we're asking 425,000 for it. 
for a car like this, that's not bad. Like yeah, so there's plenty of room for someone to yes. restore it and probably make a little bit. Yes, you know? and you've got a lot of the hard bits already. Yeah, it's a pretty complete car. Yeah, which is really great. Yeah. Excellent. Great. Daniel, thank you very much. All right, thanks a lot. Oh, you got it. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2019 Fall Meet at Hershey. Check out this 53 Cunningham. For more cool events like this, make sure you check NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com, and while you're there, post and share your events. I'll see you at the shows.